Hey guys, Bizer here, time to find out what's going on in our next Pokemon Booster Box unboxing. And as you guys can kind of maybe see, so I'm kind of sort of hiding it, but you can probably tell based on, again, the title of the video. Um, we may or may not be doing another good old nostalgia trip right here. So we have for you, for the unboxing press uh, is a Team Rocket first edition booster box from the original series, the Team Rocket booster box. So this was a really cool cool booster box and there's a nice team rocket right there you can see the camera in the uh, video as well <laughs> uh the good old team rocket so this was the uh fourth expansion in the original set so you had the base set jungle fossil and then team rocket um so the team rocket cards were the one the cards this uh series introduced the dark pokemon so you had like dark blastoise dark charizard dark primate dark machamp all that stuff so this is the set that unveiled the dark type Pokemon. Not the dark type, or not the, the typing dark, but the dark in their names. So there's a nice Team Rocket logo. I've got to catch them all. You got Team Rocket, you got um, Cassidy right there on the side. Wizards of the Coast logo. Good old Wizards of the Coast. At the back, it says Team Rocket's on the loose. The number of criminal incidents involving Pokemon has been on the rise. Some suggest it's something to do with the rash of Pokemon kidnappings that have occurred recently. Pokemon breeders believe that this is the proper way to raise and evolve Pokemon. You guys can read the rest of that if you want. This is recommended for players ages 10 and up. Each player must have 60 cards in their deck. There's this side. Gold Gyarados and Dark Slowbro in the back there. We got a Electrode and it looks like there's a Charizard as well. Yes. Focus. Focus. Come on, camera. Don't be stupid. It's gonna be stupid. It's gonna be stupid. There we are. Alright, cool. Got the back. Good old uh, sticker that was on there. That I don't know why. And yeah, we have good old Made in the US of A. Oh yeah, so this uh, the reason why I'm opening this box is because I got it for a good deal on the Ebays and it is not in collection worthy as you just saw there's a giant sticker on the back. It's already pre-ripped uh, pre for me right there and it's got a good old smashy smash right here. So that's why this box is not in the pristine collection edition. So I'm going to be opening this up for you guys and uh, it's got an Ultra Ball, I never realized that. Uh, anyway, uh, so I'm going to be opening this because, again, this is another nostalgia trip because these were packs that I opened up when I was a child. So I, I, it, was, it was fun getting these cards. I liked the, I liked the Team Rocket set. It was pretty, pretty cool. Uh, anyway, we're going to go ahead and open this bad boy up. And we're I think in, uh, I'm thinking we're going to open up all the packs. I'm thinking we're going to open up all the packs. Yeah, we'll do that. I know I said, uh, I mean, we did different with the jungle, but we're going to open them all this time. Because I really like the Team Rocket set, so we'll go. Uh, let's uh, let's uh, just, oh yeah. Goodbye, Wizards of the Coast wrapping. It was lovely, lovely having you on there for a little bit, but we're gonna open you on up. Gonna open. Oh, all right, hold on. There we are. There we is. Get that packaging all off, all off. Yeah. Get that dirty, dirty Wizards of the Coast package. Hello, oh, man. Good old. Wizards of the Coast, the perfect, perfect creators of Pokemon cards. Not really, but I still think they're the best. It's actually really cool. They only did that for this set. The first edition logo, as you can see right there, is in a Pokeball. I thought that was so cool. I don't know why they didn't do why all the other sets, you know, when they did that, they don't they don't look like that. I don't know. It's very strange. But oh, look at that. There's Giovanni coming on through with Persian. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, get this. Nice and display up and ready to go. All right, so we have the packs in here. So I'm gonna weigh. I'm gonna pause it again to weigh them, just so I can get the lightest packs. Cause I'm gonna keep. Uh, I think I'll probably keep. How many pack cards are there? There's Giovanni. There's that. There's four. Okay, so there's four different pack cards. We have uh, Jesse and James. We got the Gyarados. 
we got the pack art that has, oh, we'll do it this way, and then we got Giovanni, and we got the pack art that has all of them, all the other three on there. So I guess there's four packs, this pack's weird. Huh. Feels weird. Uh, there's four pack arts, so I guess I'll be keeping eight packs. Because I want to keep two. Each one. I also like it. It's got the black wrapper. Show neat. Show cool. You guys want that? Let's uh, let you guys take a little look at that. I some Team Rocket on the loose. Alright. So I'll be waiting. I'll be pausing the video right now. We're going to go weigh them on up. And then I shall be back. And we'll be opening up this bad boy. So see you in one quick minute. Hiya. Uh, I wasn't planning on starting the video right now, but as you can see, I'm taking the packs out of the box in order to weigh them, and I grabbed this pack, and it wasn't sealed. It was just open, and the card in there, I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, look at that. I, uh, <laughs> um, so we'll, let's, uh, let's, uh, let's explore what the heck this is right here, because I am very confused, and I don't know. Well, look at that. The ceiling print right on top of the card. So that's very weird. What the heck? Just that card? Yeah. It is. That's so weird. That's so weird. What card is it? The boss's way. So that's interesting. Damaged right from uh, that's from the factory because you just saw that I the sealed box. I just opened it right now, and this uh, apparently I don't know what the heck happened here, but this didn't. This was not sealed. Um. Huh. Very strange. Let's. I uh, wonder what uh. What cards are actually in store here? So we can learn that. We'll learn the trick too. Uh, so that's one from the back. We'll see. A little quick little uh, preview of the things to come in this set before we actually do. This. I know it's really bright. Don't worry, I'll be moving. It's in a second, I just wanna do that. There we are. Cool. Okay. So um, was not planning on opening one right now, but it was open for me. We have an oddish, slowpoke. Voltorb, Squirtle, Onita, Redata. So you got the Team Rocket logo, good old first edition. Um, Eevee, Dark Arbok, which I believe is the rare. Yep, that is the rare. Okay. Nothing fancy schmancy in this set. Dark Arbok, Dark Charmeleon, which is pretty cool. I like that card. And Dark Dragonair, which is also an awesome, awesome card. So, um, that's what we got. So it is three from the back. Yep, okay. And then we have this thing, the damaged uh, boss's way. That's so, that's so weird. All right, well, I think, I'll, I don't know. I guess I'll keep this separate or something. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know, but uh. All right, I just wanted to show you guys that because I thought it was really interesting. Uh, is there anything else? I don't know. Let's see, maybe there's anything else weird in uh, in here. So I guess we'll put, well, Jesse and James got open, <laughs> one of them. Uh, is there anything else weird? No? All right, Giovanni. Giovanni's good. Yeah, you're all good. Oh, this is, oh, I thought that was open too. I was like, what? More opened? That's just weird. I just never saw saw anything like that um, before. Quite strange to me. Alright, so I guess I'll uh, stop the recording right now. And uh, I don't know, I guess let me let me just pull out all the packs in case there's anything special. Uh, no, nah, I think I'm going to stop the recording right now. I'll be right back. Alrighty then, so this is a very, very interesting box. Um, first of all, like we had when I, I stopped the video, then I started it up back again because we had the this pack right here that was opened already and it had this weird uh, 
It's a weird card that got crimped, I guess, from the uh, the pack opening. Let me uh, fix this real quick. Yeah, there it is. Right there, you can see. Um, so I went through all the packs. I weighed them, and the weights are very strange. Uh, so I was able to get eight packs, two of each art, away. Um, but the weights were just really weird, especially with the Giovanni and the mixed one that has all four. But anyway, so there was one less Jesse and James pack, just like the um, Jungle pack, how there was one less Scyther pack. But also, <laughs> there were two more packs that were not sealed, and as you can see, have the little the, uh, the crimped card right there. You can see it right there, and you can see it right there. So, I guess we'll open these two first. And then we'll open, I think we're going to do um, six more regular packs in this video, and then we'll do ten and ten in the other two videos that we'll do. Um, so, let's go ahead and, I guess, open up this This is a very, very weird, very weird uh, booster box here with the, the packs. Very strange. Alright. So, we know that our trick is one, two, three, one, two, three. I'm saying weird because of the way that, like, things weighed. It was very strange. There wasn't very much variation in a lot in some of the things. Like there was some, but not enough to where it should be. So this should be the hollow or the hollow. I don't know if it's a hollow, but it should be the rare. Nevertheless, so we'll put you right there. We'll put you guys right here. Now let's go ahead and see what the uh, the crimp pack has in store for us. Okay. Let me get the focus good. Okay. Yeah, there we go. All right. So we got ourselves a Machop. Mankey. Sleep. And that was one of the things that the Team Rocket set has. It has, like, literally the worst trainer cards in all of the Pokemon trading called History. Because they're just, like, completely useless. Like, you have this one, Sleep. Which, yeah, flip a coin whether or not to put a Pokemon to sleep. So it's basically using a move. There's tons of moves that do that already. So it's like, okay, I'm gonna use a trainer card to um, basically have a 25% chance of my opponent being asleep. Because you have to get a 50% on the heads, and then your opponent also has to not get heads as well when they flip to wake up, so. Interesting. All right, we got a first edition Magnemite. And a Coffin. Uh, oh, well, we just like grabbed 15 cards right there, but the <laughs> Well, Meowth is the next one. And a side dock. There's the dark Jolteon. Jolteon, where were you when I was opening up my jungle packs, man? Now you're showing up here? Alright. And the nightly garbage run. He's up to three basic Pokemon cards. Of yeah. And the dark Vaporeon. So we got two evolutions. So the dark Vaporeon is the one that's got the crimping on top. So I don't really know how that happens. It's just like really bad in regards to the uh, to the um, factory, I guess. But I mean, these cards are real. You saw it was a sealed booster box. It's a Wizards of the Coast label. Everything looks right. So yeah, I don't know. Very strange. All right, so I think we'll do that. I think I'm gonna separate them much more better this time. I'm gonna keep the crimped cards. I don't know, I guess up there, something like that. So we'll put the uncommons, common, right there. Okay. And the rare from that pack is a hollow dark Machamp. So that did contain a hollow. Interesting. So our first hollow of the box is a dark Machamp. So that's pretty cool. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's check it out. All right. It's a pretty good, uh, pretty good card. Barely, little, littlest, tiniest nick right there. You can't really see it, but yeah. All right. Well, that's cool. Nice and first edition Dark Machamp. Okay. So our first Hollow of the pools is right there. So that was our first pack. Let's go ahead and get our second crimp done. Let's see what we got here see what's in store for us here maybe we can pull the rare and mystical um, error Dragonite 
Yeah, there's the Dark Dragonite Air, which is basically, uh, it's a Dark Dragonite, non-hollow version, but it is numbered the hollow version. So there was a very, very, very limited print run that happened with that. It's an incredibly rare card because there's not very many of them, so that would be quite interesting if that was the case we were able to, uh, to get that. Oh, I don't, okay. All right, all right, come here, cards. There we are. Okay, I got him. Don't worry, I got him. Okay. Let's see what's in store for us today. Alright, we got a Dratini. Look at little Dratini all hiding. He's all sad. Got his nose in the ground. It's okay, Dratini. It's okay. Don't be sad. Another Magnemite. Ponyta. Drowsy, ready to eat some children's dreams. Look at him. Look at him. Look at that face. That is the face of wanting to... That is the face of nightmares. Look at it. It's even got nightmare ability. Why is this focus not... Yeah, yeah. yeah, I guess that is, yeah, alright. Drowsy. Another coffee! And a Rattata. Nice, these are like, yeah, these are definitely a Team Rocket Pokemon we got here with Rattata and coffee and shit. We got a Goop Gas Attack, which uh, prevents all Pokemon powers from working. Alright. Dark Primeape. Look at him, he's so angry. He is so angry. They're very angry. Right. And now we got a regular Dark Vaporeon without the crimping. So that's good. And our crimp is the nightly garbage run. So that was actually kind of a, re kind of a repeat thing that happened with uh, those uncommons. But any hoosers. Okay. So let's see what the rare in the pack is. It is a non-hollow Dark Vileplume. All right, that's our rare. We'll put you right there. Okay, so we got, uh, now we'll just go on into the regular packs here. We'll open up a nice Giovanni. So six more packs to go. And then we will end this part and go on to the, the next part afterwards. Sounds good. Sounds good to me. One, two, three. All right. And then we'll grab you. Get a sleeve. I mixed up all the cards after the uh, after the weighing session, so that way you know the hollows and whatnot would be nice and mixed in there. So we should have no problems. Hopefully with that, we'll put you right there. Hopefully you guys can't see it. I don't think so. All right. So now we have the Machop of Karate Chopping. A dark ra that's a common. All right, Dark Radicate is a common. Slowpoke. Look at Slowpoke. He's all, look at He's so adorable. So just like, chilling out in his boat and ready to go. He's just freaking Ips right here. Look at Ips. Ips just chillaxing. We got a Squirtle. It's a cute Squirtle for it being an evil team rocket Pokemon, don't you think? Voltorb. A Sleep Trainer Energy once again. Diglett. I remember, this Diglett card is just always so weird to me. Like it's got, I don't know what the heck those are in the background. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't know. They look like bombs floating down. We got like this little squiggly antenna things right here, and Diglett's just like this massive thing. I don't know. I don't know, but we got a Dark Charmeleon, which is really cool. It'd be really cool if we can get a Dark Charizard Hollow. All right, Dark Charmeleon. The boss's way. And a Dark Machoke to go with our Machamp. So now we have Machop, Dark Machoke, and a Dark Machamp. So cool, we can make that whole evolutions. Right, the rare in the pack is a hollow dark hypno. All right, I didn't even realize that card was in here, but that is that card is apparently in here. Nice, and that's a hollow, right? Yep, there's a hollow, hollow dark hypno. So that's pretty cool. Let's take a look at it, looks in pretty good condition. No edge wear, I can see. How's the center in? It's pretty dang good, not too bad. It's a little off left to right, but. Not too shabby. All right, cool. So we got two hollows in this set. So that is one pack down. So five more to go, including this one. So four more after this one. And hopefully we can get ourselves. Well, okay, well this pack just yeah, that pack happened like that. <laughs> hopefully we can get ourselves some. Okay, all right, pack. Holy crap. Okay, there we are. Okay, one two. 
the re grab the rare grab it I should have a sleeve just ready before I do this I'm learning I'm learning as we go guys I'm learning as we go the Team Rocket, I like this set, because Team Rocket was one of my one of my favorite sets when I was a child. It was pretty cool, because I just like the artwork on the cards. It was cool having the dark, the evil Pokemon. I mean, look at the Psyduck. He seems like he's, I don't know, ready to torture someone with his dizziness water gun. Just look at him, he's just like, mm. got psychic powers. Granted, the Ips right here does not look like he wants to kill anybody. He's kind of just chillaxing in the rice fields, but, you know, what can you do? Got a chop, he's got his death karate chop ready to go. And Mankey's like, why? Ready to go against the Machop. We got Dark Radicate. It was like, I'm going to show you my teeth and scratch you out with my little claw right there. And then we got Diglett, which is the monster of monsters. We had dropping bombs on the back here and twiggles of death. I don't know. And Voltorb is just kind of... I don't know. He's a Voltorb. What can you do? We got Dark Rapidash doing or spirals of death. And we got a challenge trainer card. I mean, look at that. Hitmonlee karate chopping something in, or in the air. We got a Dark Electrode. I'm just ready. He's in the city. We all know what electrodes do. We know what they do. And why is he in the city? I don't know. Very suspicious. And the rare in the pack is. Is that a hollow? Oh, thank goodness. I don't like the hollow trainers just because they're kind of. I mean, I don't mind, but, you know, well, whatever. Alright, so the rare is a rocket's sneak attack. So there is a hollow version of this. And that's really all I'm going to say with that. All right, so we've got four more packs, three more after this one, and then, eh? all right, eh? yes, there we go, there we go, indeed, okay, one, two, three, thank goodness that's not in the rare, look at that right there, look at that edge whitening, I didn't get a, uh, I didn't get a sleeve ready. I'm going to now before I grab the, uh, the potential hollow with the guaranteed rare. Okay, so we got that. Grab that. Drop you all down there. Boop. Boop. I guess it doesn't really make it any easier because I'm still holding this sheet when I do things. But, anyway, whatever. Whatever. I'm going to put it like that. Uh, it might be starting to creep up now that the packs are starting to put down in there. But we won't know until... We don't want to know until I reveal it. Okay. Dratini. The Magnemite. Ponyta. Drowsy ready to eat the children's souls. Coffee and ready to boo the pollution of today. Matata. Goop gas attack. He's, co he's combining with the coffee. See, he's got co See, that's coffee and symbol right there. So clearly they're working together. Coffee is getting the goopy. And we got a Dark Charmeleon. I, I like this Dark Charmeleon card. Just look at how... Just, um, uh, I like this Dark Charmeleon card significantly better than the base set Charmeleon. I, I like the Charmant the base set Charmander is probably one of my favorite Charmanders, but the Charmeleon just doesn't look that great. This one looks pretty badass though. Dark Machope ready to lift the world right there, and another the boss's way. Okay. And the rare in the pack is a uh, energy card. Oh, I totally forgot that there were rare energy cards in the set. So we got a Rainbow Energy first edition. That is a rare. It is a non-hollow, but it is a rare nonetheless. Okay, so that was one, we went one, two. We've opened five packs, so we've got three more to go. Three more to go in this first pot. Seems like the bottoms of the packs are are uh, working pretty good with me, at least wanting to actually open. So that's nice. Because otherwise, we're just not having a good time, and we don't like that. One, two, three. And four. And get to these sleeves of sleeving. I will end up probably... Sl I will sleeve up um, all the non-repeat cards, basically. That's what I do. So I have, like, all the... Like, I'll have a complete set of the commons and uncommons and regular rares, and I'll sleeve those up. And then I will just like keep the other ones in just a the sheet by itself okay so grammar this is one of the interesting cards because it was censored or it wasn't censored it was altered from the japanese version because if you can see grammar's eyes are just like looking straight at you but in the japanese versions his eyes are actually peering up towards the skirt of the chick right here the silly japanese you can actually kind of tell i don't know let me see if i get really close and then we can uh focus 
camera. Yeah, so you can see like his eye right here. This eye is all the way to the right. So they edited only the left eye because before it was just like this one was like that. Always to the right. And then this one was all the way to the right up. So it looked like it was peering up her skirt. So America version censored that. <laughs> okay. So Grimer. Can I fix this? Let's see. That's better. There we go. Okay, so we got to sleep. And Abra, and then... <laughs> this this one was another one, too. It just... This looks... Abra just looks so uncomfortable there, because it's, like, sitting at the... You can see the... That the, uh, the roofs right there are pointy. So, I don't know what Abra's doing. It, it, it doesn't look like a very fun time. We got Ekans. Another Psyduck. Ready to destroy the souls. I got Charmander. See, this is the opposite. I don't like this Charmander card. It just doesn't look cool. The base set Charmander looks significantly better than this one, but, you know. Whatever, but we do have a Charmander, so that's cool. And we have the Machop ready to chop off some people. Dark Electrode. We got a Dark Flareon now, so now we have all three Dark Evolutions, which is cool. We didn't get the Jolteon in the jungle, but what are you going to do? And a Dark Muck. That is the final common card. And the rare indie pack is going to be a... Non-hollow Dark Charizard. I put this in upside down, didn't I? Yes, sir. I did. That's right. We can fix that. I can fix that. Dark Charizard, non-hollow, but that's still cool. See, that's what I was talking about. Why well, I'm not... Uh, I decided to do it for Team Rocket just because Team Rocket was a cool set, but... I don't like how they did this. They're just The rares and the hollows are the exact same cards. It's just there's non-hollow and hollow versions, but... What can you do? So that was, uh, two, four, six. So we got two more packs to go. And then that will be the end of this part. All right, it's nice and Jesse James pack. So one, two, three. Grab the hollow. Put y'all down. Get sleeve. Oh, oh dear. All right, hold on. My sleeves of sleeving have sleevenly fallen. That's, I put you in upside down. Why, why do I do this? Why do I do this? Right. Put you right there. Grab the sleeves because they fell down on the floor. Alright. Cool. And I gotta remember to put these cards up the correct way when I put them in the sleeves. Come on, Bizer. You can do this. You can do this. Alright, side up. Beckins. Mankey going, oh, yeah, to battle the Machop. Mankey and Machop, I think, are mortal enemies in this pack, because you can just tell. And then you got Raticate kind of like, like, I don't know what to do. We got Ips sleeping in the boat again. Squirtle blowing them bubbles. Hey, Potion Energy. Which is, is that an uncommon? Or I can't even see. God, that's so stark. That's an uncommon. Can't even see the symbol. It's so dark. We got a dark Golbuck. Golbuck? A Golbuck. A Golduck. See, this is what happens. Psyduck drains his energy and evolves into a Golduck and she can shoot a laser beam of death. We got another Dark Jolteon. I actually like this Jolteon card. It's really cool. But that electricity. I wish this was a rare because that would be a pretty badass hollow with that. Anyway, the rare in the pack is a non hollow Dark Hypno. <laughs> See? There's the prime example of nice and one hollow and non hollow. So. I suppose that is definitely a thing. We've already seen the hype now, so we're just going to move on right there. And we're going to grab ourselves a new pack right now. Right now. And this is the final pack in this video. There will be the next part going up in another couple of days or so. And hopefully we can get ourselves a Dark Charizard Hollow. That's what we want is the Hollow. Oh, one, two, three. Grab that, grab this, put those like that. We grab the packs the correct way this time. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Shall I round tire? And we'll see what is in what is in store in the final pack of this first part of our Team Rocket first edition opening booster box. We got the Drowsy and the Ponyta, the Vertiri, the Koofing. The Meowth getting ready to get some paydays. Got the Goop Guest Stack combining with the coughing. But a Zubat, first time we pulled a Zubat. That's a, that's a cool Zubat card. It's got the Moon of Death in the background. Pretty cool. 
Dark Dragonair, which is an awesome card, which we pulled in, I believe, the first um, crimp, uncrimped one, or whatever. The pack that was open, that I didn't open. Dark Rapidash. And, um, oh, Magikarp is uh, uncommon. Of course it is. Magikarp, for some reason, is always an uncommon. Even though it's a Magikarp. But I guess no one... You don't fuckle with the Magikarp, do you? It's like you don't fuckle with the Shuckle, you don't, you don't fuckle with the Magikarp. Alright, the final rare in the first part of our Team Rocket First Edition Booster Box is... A Holo Dark Alakazam. So that's pretty nice. That's pretty nifty. That's Holo, yes. Yeah, number one. Number one. Let's take a look at that bad boy. Yep, you can see the nice and hollow right there. Any scratches? No scratches. Let's take a look at the back. Back looks pretty nifty too. So that's pretty good. Cool, 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 cool. So not a bad showing in the first uh, pause of this series. We got three hollows. We got a Dark Champ, a Dark Hypno, and a Dark Alakazam. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and are pumped and ready to go for this old school booster box unboxing. Once again, if you did, steer that like button down below. Also remember to click the link in the description to follow me on Twitter because it's post updates to the channel, all those cool things and stuff. And I also give away free Pokemon TCGO cards if you want to play that thing. Give them away daily on the Twitters. So make sure you follow to get one of them cards. Maybe even subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And I guess I'll See you guys later.